What's up guys, General Incompetence here and welcome to episode 8 of the Iceni campaign on Rome 2 Total War. Um, at the time of recording it is the morning of Friday the 9th of September um, and just over 12 hours ago um, it was made public knowledge that Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II of England has passed away. Um, I just wanted to, I don't know, just say something a little bit about it, um, just because it's quite important to me. And I, I, I don't know, I feel like it's quite fitting that our opening gambit on this episode is going to be with our own Queen of England. Um, look, um, I am quite traditional in my views. I am. I hate any Republican sentiment um, when it comes to the UK. I'm not talking about you American Republicans, I'm talking about people that want to abolish the monarchy um, of our great nation which is you know a monarchy that has stood for over a thousand years you know um i think it's bullshit um i am very pro monarchy and what they stand for it doesn't mean to say i'm going to be necessarily you know in my personal opinions pro the monarch um you know i think it would be far greater of wills Will, uh, william was going to take the throne but we have king charles the third he is going to be, and he is now our king. And I'm, you know, I will be singing God Save the King. Um, but yeah, it's very, it's a very sad day for this country. I think, you know, whether you're pro the monarchy or not, everyone kind of feels it in the country at the moment. And it's like, yes, you know, our family has lost their mother, grandmother or a great grandmother, but I feel like the, the nation has also lost its matriarch. You know, to my parents, it's like they've lost a, a mother. To people of my generation, you know, I'm 29 years old. It's like I've lost some sort of estranged grandmother or great aunt or something. Um, it's strange times um, and it is very sad. So I just wanted to say that just to begin with the episode. And it is fitting that we are going to be victorious with our own Queen of England. We are going to go and smack. I think this is the Averni. Um, let's do it. For the Queen, we shall go into battle. Yeah, very sad, very sad times, very sad times. But, we ride, we, with the consorts of Morrigan, whoever Morrigan is, um, we are going to be taking out this Averni settlement and expanding, expanding ourselves on Northern Europe. She is going to become our Queen in the North. Right. Okay, I think we're only actually going to get snow. Let's just check. Yeah, we're only going to... It's winter, so... Remember that the goal here is to capture... Fuck off. Tell me what to do. Right. So, what I want to do is bombard the walls. I want to take out as many of them on the walls as possible. But I also want to have a two-pronged attack. So... I think what I'm going to do is have this detachment of Ironborn on this side. And spread them out nicely along the walls. And I'm not going to have any ladders on this side because I'm going to batter down the walls with my ballista. Should be able to get three that side. And to this side. In fact, let's take that one and put it here. Should be fine. And we won't move you guys in yet. We shall wait. Damn right you are. You can see, this is where I wish I had more ballista because I could actually smash them on the walls. We're going to have archers. We're going to be using them to good effect. And our cavalry just kind of hang around at the back. We aren't going to need you too much just yet. If at all. Okay. Let's get at least get the gates down first. Yeah, we want to try and kill as many of them as we can. But we also need to get the gates open and make sure that we have an avenue of attack open to us. What kind of range do we have? Uh, 
hope the trees aren't blocking my uh, shots too much. No, that's fine. And I ideally want to take out these towers as well. And then I can move my own archers forwards. Let's just speed this up. There we go. Okay, the gate is down. Gatehouse isn't 100%, but you can't have everything. Come on, be more accurate. Okay, now the gatehouse is down. Oh, that was crap. Come on, guys. Go barely gonna have any ammo left. Okay, now that's down. Good. Now this one. Pick your targets. Aim small, miss small. Jesus. Can hit the side of a barn door right now. There we go. Right. Now, let's get this down. Yes, I haven't taken out that one yet, but I do want at least one more hole in the wall. One more access point for us. And you know what? Let's take out that as well. Come on. Damn it. Right, okay. I'm out of ammo. So, next up... Bowman. Do your worst. Ironborn, move up just behind. They've put some of their uh, skirmishes over there, which kind of makes sense. But if we weaken them on this side, we haven't got as many entry points, so if we can weaken them a little bit. Oh, we're being shot. I don't know where those shots are coming from. But we can't see them yet, so we're going to have to move up. I think they've probably got some archers on here that we can't see yet. So we get ourselves closer. There they are. Right. Unleash hell. Go on. Oh, yeah. We can whittle them down here. At least that'll make up for the lack of access points that we have on this side. Oh, look at that. They're getting smushed. Because loads of them are out from cover. And that'll do it for that unit. Wonderful. Well done. Let's move up a little bit. I was hoping there might be a unit there that we could shoot at that didn't have any cover. can we get a them? Mm. Couple of volleys, I reckon. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah. Oh, they're really dropping now. And they're wavering. Dust thing, when a, a unit wavers and routes in this game, it doesn't go back to their, like, center or anything. They just run off the battlefield. Now, stop fire at will. Actually, no, don't stop fire at will. Fire at them. Yeah, fire on those Celtic warriors. Oh, they've disappeared. Yeah, I don't want them to waste their arrows on them. Because they've already gone. They're kind of irrelevant now. They're shattered. Fire on them. 
Oh, look at that. Straight through the shields. He's got one in the face. Oh, see, this is why we get archers. For this exact reason that I love having archers in my army because look at the absolute devastation it's, they're causing. Okay, yeah, they're all dead. Right, let's move up again. Hopefully they'll send us another sacrificial unit. Oh, there we go. Some Celtic warriors there that we can kill. Let's just move over slightly. Oh. We're just wiping out entire... Oh, no, that's not good. That's not good. Move, 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 move back. Out of range. Please, you're still in range. That was silly. That was silly of me. Are we out of range now? Nope. There is where we want to be. There we go. Now, do your thing. Where are they going? As long as they're within sight, that's fine. As long as we can see them, we can kill them. You know what? Quick reload. Get them down. I mean, a lot of arrows are being blocked, but it's killing enough of them. Ah, that's good. Bring them down here in range of everyone. Oh, yes. One more volley. Volley! And there they go. Lovely. That's another unit down. Good stuff. Just check that I'm not going to be in range of that tower. Okay, so that's the that's the range of that tower there. So it should be okay like that. Let's move up the chosen swords. They're ironborn even. Oh bloody hell. It's off. Turns out that's the that's the range by the looks of it. Right, I don't know where the rest are, but I think we should start moving in on this side. And start taking the walls. We are gonna definitely take some damage on our way in. But we shall look to secure the secure those towers ASAP. And I think the time has come to start moving in over here as well. You capture that. You move up here. And this is certainly going to reveal some targets for my archers, I reckon. Can you guys not run? No, because you've got ladders. Okay, in we go. Still no units revealed. Yet. In fact, tempted to captured that arrow tower especially if we were in range and get start getting shot from behind oh we're immediately in range of that as well right move up there you move there 
you move there. You go to secure that. We're going to run into them eventually. I just don't know where they are yet. Get the archers in. Ah, here we go. Go on, take out those naked warriors. You're much better. And I've just given you all the boosts. Oh yeah, they're dropping like flies already. And we should stop getting shot from behind shortly. Yeah. Ah, here they are. Okay. Come on, what are you doing? Get in there. Don't hang around. Fact, let's move them over here. Oh, they've sent in another unit. It's okay. Why? I don't understand what's happening here. Just get in there. Go on. There we go. We should be fine. Go on. Open fire. Good. You two move up. Right now, start hitting them from behind. You move in there. What on earth are these guys doing? Oh, shit. I didn't want to do that. Right, you lot, get in there. Yeah, this is going okay. We're doing all right. Oh, nice javelin throw there. They're a little bit single file, but that's okay. We can make it work. They're wavering. They're going to break. There we go. Move in there. Excellent. I mean, yeah, you're pretty fucked. So you can just go over there and chill. I'd say this was going well. You guys are finally joining the party. You can secure the gatehouse. They're going to have nowhere to run. Go on. Throw your javelins. Wash. There we go. Charge, charge, charge. Pin them.
That's a pretty damaged unit. That's okay. Right, you lot. Move up. Exhausted? Do we have... No. We don't have second wind yet. Got most of the towers that I'd want. I just don't want to re. I just don't want to charge into any spear warriors. I just don't. I don't need to use a. Okay, we nearly secured this. Okay, that's secured. In you go. You know what? We are going to bring her up. Right, those, those skirmishes are done. Is there any danger of uh, moving us around behind? Can't, can't really tell. Frenzied. Uh, frenzy and frenzy charge. Get in there. Yeah, they're shaking now. In comes some fresh ironborn. Love it. Alright, what's happening over here? They're all breaking. Mass route. Excellent. There we go. Decisive victory. They held their ground. They took a lot. They took a battering, but they did well. Look at the archers. Yeah, we need to... I hope they don't disappear. 239 for this unit. It's great showing. And a couple killed by the ballista, but that's fine. Any day now. Here we go. Uh, it looks like we uh, killed a lot of our own troops. Oh no, it'll be the arrow towers, no doubt, as well. Bit of friendly fire. That's all good. Oh, they survived. They survived. Right, let's occupy. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Yep. And... Yep. Okay, we do want second wind. We want group second wind. So we want this. Because group second wind is a very, very useful thing to have. That gets raised the banner and rally and inspire. That eventually we'll get war cry. That's a good one to have as well, but I think this is good for recruit now. And plus two to recruitment. So melee attack skill and missile attack range. I guess we're more getting it for the skills that it would get us, like raise banner. So that's fine. Right. I live to serve the people of Britain. Okay. Whatever this is, we want rid of it. And what are we going to replace it with? Um, so that's the place we need to have next.
So it's good for public order. Oh, let's just have a look. What I mean, what are we looking at here? So Celtic, okay, culture, culturally, we're absolutely fine. As soon as we get rid of conquest, public order will be fine. So we're not really worried there. Mm, you know what? I'm not even sure that I want this. Food is our biggest problem. And this. Let's have a look. Let's have a look, see. Hmm. That's going to give us more wealth. Well, let's go for that then. Because we do want to keep our economy shifting. Let's go for that. We'll upgrade that. You shall be going here next because we're going to want to complete this province. Good. You're on the move. We have our navy here. We're not at war with them yet, but we need to keep a sharp eye on them. They're being a bit pesky. Okay. Good. Now, you should have a war maiden there. You do, so you are being improved. How are things at home? Things are okay. Steady, I would say. Things are steady. Now, we're getting better horses soon. Some uh, The ability to have some better cavalry. Let's have a look. Anything we can do for our queen? No. You have no husband. Because your husband died. Alright then. Let's get you a hubby. Any good? Oh, look at that. More chance of having children, more wealth from culture, and plus two to zeal. That's a great result. Well done, sir. Apparently he's got an arrogant wife. Huh. <laughs> Okay, and who else have we got? Who else have we got that's important that's in the field? You're important in the field. What can we do for you? You are a good wife. That is expensive. Damn. Okay. I know that you're... You're a heavyweight. That's expensive. Promotions are starting to get pricey. Hmm. Okay, so you're not even in the field yet. You're not in the field. None of yous have armies. Just want to make sure that I'm doing right by everyone that I've got kind of on the front lines. But so far, I'd say we're, we're doing okay. Now. They apparently like me, apparently, yet they're camping out right near me. They're not going to like me after I invade them. Okay, the Avernia down there. Right. You guys apparently like me. So how about we actually trade? And burden yourself of the you know, so I know someone commented on uh, the last episode, if you're not going to attack someone, then get... Um, you know, get some non-aggression packs. I'm like, okay, cool, but we will gladly listen to your offers, but do not wrap them. No one eyes. wants non-aggression packs with me. You know, even your people that apparently come, like me. We have no need to share glory. So no one wants to trade, well, even though I now have resources. Sit and let your words move me. No one wants I to trade, and no one wants non-aggression. So there's not really much I can do about that. I'm doing my best, but you know. If they don't want it, they don't want it. Only so much I can do at that point. We have seen See, look, they are demanding five and a half grand. Not a chance. So 
tell you what, I'll give you... I don't even want to give you that. Because it's not worth it. Nope. My people can only dream. No, nope, I'm not giving you money. And, and I'm certainly not giving you a non-aggression pact. No. It's not happening. Sorry. Not interested. Because you guys I'm taking out next anyway. Oh, that's got a resource that does. And a faction rises. Liguria. Construction complete. Okay, we've got our cattle pens over here. So let's pop that in. And what's this? You know what? That's probably a good thing to get us a better garrison. And a bit more wealth. And you know what? We'll just... We've got money at the moment to spend. Let's spend it. Get you over here. In you go, my friend. Now, I wanted to get Trevorum, but that has a resource. And we're going to be probably attacking the Swabi at some point anyway. Let's have a quick look here. Here, and then we'll move the spy down. Okay, so they have forces here. Got you. I mean, they're not amazing forces. Gallic Hunters. Mine are better. Mercenary Cavalry. My infantry is much better. Oh, okay. So that's where all their forces are. And they do have some here as well. Okay. I mean, they just have a, an easy advantage when it comes to numbers. Fact. And we've got a decent garrison, but it's not going to be good enough to stand on. It's just in its own merit. We will be getting some ballista and some scorpions. Okay. Now, what are we... Yes, we are getting infantry chain mail so we can upgrade our barracks again as well. I think if we were going to go after the Nervi, Nervii, we would need this army as well. And I just think that at the moment... Hang on, how are we doing? Okay, military presence, so I'd still get plus one, so things would be steady enough. So, let's bring them over. Let's do that. We don't really need protection at home. We can raise a force real fast if necessary. If things start getting, getting silly. Okay. Good. Hmm. And you guys like us and you are willing to trade. You are lots of... Oh, you're just importing loads. I just don't understand why these guys... Trading with you would be very worthwhile. You know what? I would be willing to offer you some cash. The gods rightly wish us to show humility and not enrich ourselves at your expense. And I can perhaps go a little bit more bespoke. Okay, let's do that. Still low. Don't understand that. Trade would be in both of our um, interests. Well, these, they got nothing to offer, so I'd be helping well, them out. They just don't want it. Alright, be like that. See if I care. Dickheads. Oh, 
Oh, they finally moved away. Good. I'm pleased to see it. Right. A f another family seeks to adopt one of your characters. Just a politician. He's got very low gravitas. Very unimportant. Sure, have him. Not bothered. Political intrigue. Yeah, that's fine. Subject games notoriety. A foreign trader. A Greek trader has come to the tribe offering to trade the sweet wines of his homeland. Uh, allow this man to meet with local traders to help encourage others to visit the lands or monopolize. Those who have tasted it say the wine is the nectar of the gods. Control such a fine thing as it would be profitable indeed. Okay. Let's monopolize. Let's continue your progression over onto the mainland. Um, shall I keep you here? I'm a little bit concerned that those swordsmen are a little bit outdated. But if I'm going to redo this army, I might as well do it when... That's eight. Oh, that's going to be ages. It's going to be 11 turns until we can get some new new men. I mean, what's the difference? 31, 37 versus... Thirty-eight, forty-four. Okay, there is quite a big difference between them and the Ironborn. So, yeah, let's disband them. Is it worthwhile getting some great spears? I just don't see the advantage of them, really. We're not up against that much cavalry. We might as well just load up on Ironborn. It kind of makes more sense. If we were up against, you know, a cav centric um uh, a, ca a cavalry centric faction then i'd be like yeah let's get some more great spears but the ironborn are doing plenty they're just cutting down they're cutting down fools settlement sabotage get that done Oh, they're going... They've just invaded them. Maybe if they go off that way, we can kind of hit them in the back. We can do like a two-pronged attack. Eventually, I can move this army out and start... There isn't too much I can do with this fleet at the moment because there's no one that we really want to attack from the sea or that we can attack from the sea. We don't want to have a go at the Frizzy Eye yet. Mm. We definitely want to keep the fleet because it's useful. Mm -hmm. Right now, you don't like me. What have I done? Battle support for... I don't recall giving them battle support any time recently. So like, certainly not since last turn. Weird. I don't know. Let's move on. Oh, the Avernia is still around. Okay, War Maiden has increased. So we definitely want Drill Sergeant. Charge bonuses, yeah, that looks good, Frenzied. Yep, that's it. Good, motivated population, we have our stables. Good. Quartermaster's report and our druid has increased in rank. Now, what does that actually mean? Yep, we want to do that. And what's this? Yep, this also increases 
our army's melee attack, so that's definitely what we want. Good, good, good. This guy is getting tanky. I like it. I like it a lot. Now, we have we can now get better cavalry, but we can only do that back home. So I guess whatever next army we raise, that shall be what we shall do. Now, they look like they've relatively abandoned these. Now, do I want to assassinate you? Sure. Die. Take that bitch. It is done. You can't actually level up anymore, can you? The nope. You're maxed out. I can recon them again next turn just to see what's going on. There's not too much we can do just yet. We need to get over here first, which is going to take a couple of turns. Hopefully these guys will keep getting trained. Come on. They probably just didn't get trained at sea, which is fair enough. Now, apparently we have plus, plus two wine per region, but it's not showing up anywhere. You guys still not liking me? No. Now, you're at war with the Nervii. Well met, friend. What about if we... words move me to anger or agreement, as you wish of them. I thank you for the offer, <sighs> but we are not with No, they're not interested. I mean, they will be after I attack the Nervii, but at the moment, they're not having it. Oh, well. Now, who is... I want to get you in the mix. And you are who... Ab and Ad -bit Ad Bitos. Where are you? Here you are. I will pay for you to get a promotion. There we go. You're kind of beastie. I think what I'd almost be more likely to do would be to put this army here and move this army next turn out. I mean, they're not going to get trained. Or I could swap the armies over. Could do that. Or just swap the agents over. Hmm. You know, it's probably going to be a better idea to make these two meet and give this army... Give... Add Bitos that army and Iburus. Actually, they're both pretty good. Doesn't really matter, does it? Not that important. We'll figure that out. But for now, we're just going to have to roll through the turns. Oh. Gold freely given and no, because I want to attack you now. And I'm still not... I'm still not willing so to give you money. Goes. Nope. We have seen Nope, not happening. Soz, not interested. Gold freely given and what? Why? Why would I give you money? Blessing from the gods to all involved. So no. see the bones. Not happening. Yeah, faction. I saw that the Averni weren't on the factions I was at war with, so they're gone. Okay, this army. Warriors all ready for battle. Let's put you there. Warriors all. Put you here. Oh, we can't do that. Unless... All of them... Or all of them... Okay. So... But you still have the druid. 
So we're going to need to get you... So that was kind of pointless in a way. No, a bit more experience here. So Druid goes there. War Maiden goes there. Druid in there. You are going to go there for now. And you are going to come over here. Right. Good. You know what? Mm. I don't think they're going to attack me. Those could be famous last words. But I don't think they are. You know what we're going to do? We're going to get ourselves a spy just to make sure. I definitely don't want that. Okay. I'm going to get you, and you are going to make sure that we're in the clear, and both of you are going to move over to the frontiers. And help with my expansion. If I need to build a new army, I can do so, because I've got plenty of cash. Right. You know what? Should we get that? Minus three to public order. How are we doing public order wise? Not best, actually. I just don't want to bother raising a new army until I can build this. There's just no point. If I'm going to get a new army, I want the good shit. You know what? We will get that. Why not? Screw it. I know I didn't do anything with my spy, but I don't necessarily need to at the moment. They've moved off there again. I think we're only going to need one army going this way, and then two or three this way. That's how we're going to do it, I reckon. That's going to be the best plan of action. Infantry chainmail done. I am the knife in the dark. Mission failed. Oh, oh well. Okay. Ah, yes. Let's build those now. Just invest the money. Get them in. Okay. Do we actually have any missions right now? No active missions. Fine. So we can research whatever we want. Well, there's no point really doing anything more on this for now, because we're very well researched. Could get one of those too, but what can we get for our economy? Uh, wealth from all commerce. Wealth from agriculture. I did kind of want this druid judgment. growth I think we're going to go for druid judgment next because it does make political costs much cheaper there's less corruption and we can get a bard's grove and that's going to help us with um, increasing the rate of research which is uh, going to be important for later game so let's move you lot over here Okay, let's just make sure no one is playing silly buggers and steal food and you can recon these guys there we go now we can see everything oh they've taken it so what's happening with the frizzy eye now they are in a bad place. Yeah, we are going to need to strike and strike soon. What I think I'll do is send one army in there to take it. And then have armies on the border. So, you know, it's a tough ask for them to counterattack. I mean, our infantry is just so superior to theirs. So we should be able to cut through them 
but they just have numbers. Hopefully I've not forgotten anything. Oh, and how you see now now you're interested. No. In you, I believe we have such friends. No. My people can No. We have seen Fine. You wanna keep being dicks? Two can play that game. You know what? I could even take my fleet and attack attack them on the coast. We could literally like absolutely go to town on them. That'd be fun. Right. Let's get that. That. Keep marching, boys. Keep marching. Good. Everything's nicely upgrading there. Public order isn't amazing, but who cares? Straight gain for our queen. Let's go. We are going to recon again. Want to keep a sharp eye on everything that's happening. Very expensive to have to recon every turn. Right. Yeah. They just have a lot of armies. And they're full stacks as well. How are we doing? We're doing well. Everyone is training nicely. Lovely. Now, I think I will send... You're an, you're an important general. Oh, and you've still got the bloody druid. I thought you were going to have the war maiden. Ah, screw it, who cares? I think I will send you lot this way. Uh, this way. And Billy Big Balls, you can hold out on your own. But if, you, if you're playing Billy Big Balls, I'm going to swap these over again, you know. Oh, I can't do that. Yeah, I can't do that. Okay, that's fine. It's all good. You still. You honor us. Ah. There's... I cannot settle on such terms. Your people are worthy, but my people deserve better of our talk. There we go. Right. All praise to the gods. Excellent. Now, I should. Okay. Who are you? And what about you, Fox? Okay, so you're at war with the Avachi. And your allies with them that I've not discovered yet. I will do you the honor of listening to your terms. Hope no. The gods. All right, that's fine. That's fine. Ah. A feast. That's good. Happy days. I won't bother reading all that. Okay. Yep. And what else can we get? Unit replenishment? Sure. Ready for battle. Right. You are moving there. On the move, lads. I'm just going to keep it as it is. 
you are moving there. Let's take a quick look. Okay. I like what I see. Oh, we're starting to get some gold chevrons in this place now. In our queen's army. Yeah, we're definitely going to hit here first. Next turn. And just as soon as... As soon as this is built, I'll start building up a th um, another force as well. It's good that we've now got trade agreements with them because then they're less incentivized to attack us. Okay. Intimidate opposition. Local bandits have offered their service to intimidate the opposition. How do you respond? I'm going to refuse. Um, they might. Yeah, I'm going to refuse. We don't need to do that. They might go and work for our enemies, but that's fine. Who are these? They're an African faction. Want to trade? Speak, my friend. Probably not. Oh, moderate. Okay, hang on. Gods rightly wish us to show humility and not enrich ourselves at your expense. Okay, that's high, but we can't offer any less than that. There we go. I will accept more trade. Right, what about you guys? Come on. Come, my friend. Speak. Be sensible. We are men of words, and so serve our peoples with honor. What is the, the matter with you guys? You're being knobs. At least we're expanding our little trade empire. But I think it's about time we expanded our empire empire. Alright, let's do that again. Oh, wow. Oh, this is perfect. This has worked out so, so well. Oh, this is unbelievable. We're going to have a free chance to just absolutely destroy the Nervii. And that's where we're going to end it for, the, for this episode. On a cliffhanger. Next episode, we will be moving straight in and taking both of these settlements. And moving in a, um, our queen to reinforce as well. So we should be able to hold them off. I think it would make sense to try and get an alliance with Frizii if we need to. But I might also move... How far can this fleet go? How long would it take? How many turns? It's quite a few turns. Mm. No, I shall leave them there for now, just in case these guys do play city buggers, even though we do have a trade agreement with them now. Um, well, plus two to cunning... Oh, plus 10% chance of critical success in action. Let's do that. Sounds good. Um, yeah, we'll leave them there for now. But yes, we are poised. We are poised with the invasion. It's going to happen. So if you enjoyed this episode, please do hit the like button. Um, leave me a comment in the comment section down below if you've got any suggestions on things you'd like me to do different. Um, and as always, you know, if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe for more content. Um, I've just started my new Alemanni series on Total War Rome Remastered Barbarian Invasion. We continue with Egypt and we're going to continue with this. So until the next one, bye for now.